back at the the site of our last disaster. Oh man, Poo Lagoon. You poor thing, why did it have to be you? Of all the places. But we're going to avoid this crisis because now Tracy fucking Island is over here and we are gonna... They, they're gonna keep us safe, I imagine. Or at least save some of the people. Although, to be honest, I don't think we really want them saving the people from Poo Lagoon. They're not really worth it. I kind of want to jazz this island up a bit at some point. I think I think this island deserves a bit more love, as Tracy Island was a really, really cool looking place. Whereas this is a bit kind of, um, it's a bit flat, but that's that's fine. I still, I still love Tracy Island, you're good. So, the rest of the city is doing all right. We have a few problems. We need more water at some point. I think our landfills are just a mess. But that's okay too. Oh man. But we're not that far off getting the next the next stuff. We can get kind of uh we can get some incendiary um that's not what they're called. Uh incinerators. And that that will that, that will start like dealing with trash. Like that's kind of um I always feel like the incinerators are the first big sort of thing that you get that really, really radically change change what you're doing. That and um High density stuff. So we're gonna call this place because we love the Ovla but so much. Ovla Buttier. So someone mentioned it should be called Ovla Buttier, and I liked it. That was good. Um, and I do know I owe a couple of people street names, but because of us updating to play with disasters, a whole bunch of the mods broke, and I just haven't had time to go through that gigantic list of mods, which I did add some more to, to try and work out what we were going to, like how, how that was going to work, because there was conflicts, things weren't loading, and it's one of the reasons why I haven't been putting out putting out as many um, as many City Skylines videos as I'd like, just because they're a ball ache, uh, and especially setting up all that tech. Man, we are doing great for cash. Hooray, but I know we have issues. Before in the past we said we'd neglect the people of Coltsburg, but I don't think we can. I don't think we're um I don't think we're gonna do that anymore. We're gonna give them their own medical centre. So hopefully that should spread out. Uh, these guys are a bit sad. And also we need education because we have only one tiny little school trying to support everyone at the moment. And we need we need some more schooling going on, especially over here in Coltsburg. So, I think I think having like the primary school right next to the Colt headquarters is quite like a strong move, as you want to get the kids early. If I know anything about cults, which isn't a lot, it's you want to get the kids into the cult as soon as you can. Like really, really indoctrinate them when they're young. So I think that that's going to help Coltsburg, and. Probably Ovlabutia could do with do with one as well. So what are we doing here? Because we're making so much cash. Do you want on the main road? Or like just in one? Maybe like somewhere in the middle. Could be nice. On the curve? By the ramp? Yeah, that sort of helps. Okay, that's great. And we we, we should probably get at least a high school. Oh man, we are burning through cash now. That's fine. You know, it's always fun to, to be on the ropes when it comes to money. Maybe. Should we just plonk it down here? Do you reckon this like the sunny side school? Yeah. Sunny side high school. Sunny side high school. Perfect. Okay, now, with everyone getting a bit more educated, it's something I always kind of like neglect but it helps everyone out. You get like higher density buildings, less trash, less fires. Oh, being smart is, is totally OP. It's really, really good. I can't recommend, you know, the smart build high enough. Specking all your points into being smart. Like, man, there's so many advantages. Probably not, probably not as many as being beautiful. I reckon that's, that's better, but we can't really put a beauty salon in. At least I don't think you can have a beauty salon. No, maybe basketball, you know, playing basketball, that makes you healthy. Who knows? It'll be fine. Oh, a theme park. We're going to have to have a theme park at some point, but not yet. 
So what are we looking for? We, we just need more people. Way more people. Maybe over there is good. Or we can ignore the more people. Actually, no, fuck, we totally need... We need definitely need some more. So we can just put, like, some little bits in. How about we just extend out this kind of area? A fraction. Oh, it's all a bit... All a bit wonky, but that's fine. We don't need the mega grids. Oh no. Sure, that road is okay. So it's not a huge increase in numbers, but it's just enough, I reckon, to help us out. As I tend to get a bit overkill when I'm doing stuff, I want to throw down a whole ton of, you know, I see that I need some industry, so I built a, just a gigantic industry sector when I should have probably even built one of those squares and kind of slowly trickled up, made like little bits here and there, but instead, no, we did the whole the whole fucking thing in one go, which wasn't wasn't very good. Now, what else do we want? So, transport, but I don't really know how to do transport very well. It's something I always mess up. I spend a shitload of cash on transport, and it just doesn't fucking do anything for me at all. And I kind of, kind of want to do a tram, I reckon. So we do have this big main mega road. Although, we've got this roundabout, and I'm worried about this roundabout. Like, there's a tram coming in here, it's going to slow everything down. So maybe we need to, like, run the tram line over? Because even if it comes through, then people have to stop for it. Oh, transport sounds like a, a pain in the ass, actually. Oh, shit. Water. The benevolent god. He provides water. There we go. While we're, while we're just blowing cash away, what else do we have? Fire safety. Not great. Wow, even over here. Oh, I guess maybe because there's so much industry. We probably don't want the mega fire station. But we can have a little fire station. I reckon right by, right by the oval button. And Coltsburg, do they want one? Maybe like here? On like the, the sort of weird road? Yeah. Okay, Coltsburg, there's not gonna be any like, you know, wicker men burning anything down today. I finally, police. Crime rate's very low. Jail availability, availability very low. Let's have, let's have, let's have some police over here as well. Opposite the fire station. Okay, maybe not opposite the fire station. How about that? Okay, sure. Right. Okay, we've fixed a whole load of problems. And last of all, while we're on fixing mode, before we do something a bit more, a bit more fun, is I think it's time for us to get another water thing. Maybe we should just start moving the water up here, away from, uh, away from like the really dense part of. Oh, let's pause it for this. The really dense part of Ovalbutia. They don't need anyone kind of like hassling them. There we go. Perfect. So that should solve the water problems. Sewage is great. We're gonna have more power issues. And maybe we do get some of these special guys. Do you want some of those? I don't really like the look of them though. They're a bit they're a bit ugly. So we could just do oil instead. It's really expensive. Man, that'll take so much out of our weekly budget. But then again. So how much is that getting us? I guess it's a whole load of power. But these get us. Get us a whole load too. Hmm. And it's cheaper. But they are uglier. Tough call. I guess power's a bit like hookers. Like, the cheaper it is, the uglier it is. We'll do it for now. Because we don't have massive power problems, but it's the kind of thing that I feel is going to fuck us in the future. And we'll connect it up to, connect it up to here. And then run the Tracy Island power line 
along uh, like this. And power is fine as well. Holy shit. It's all, all great. Man, good employment rates as well. I guess even people in um, Pool Lagoon are getting employed. Oh shit. No more room. No more room. Ugh. And they literally have no more room now. Wow. Okay. So we're going to need garbage. Oh, maybe, maybe like a town over there. Although I kind of want to keep this more industry and the town stuff will come up from, from elsewhere. So let's just... Oh shit. Why is water not getting down here? That's all flashing a lot. Okay. It's fine. Man, we really do need those incinerators, don't we? So let's just have a little thing come off here. I don't really want them to have proper roads. I want it to be like a dirt track. And just come down like this. Yeah. And then a little straight bit. And hopefully they, they won't pollute this river or anything. As, um, that would suck. Here we go. One, two, and it's too steep. Two, three. Sure. Because we, we will kind of clear all that stuff up later on. And those guys can come out, add a whole load of traffic to uh, this area. Do I actually need garbage closer to these guys? Hmm, maybe I do. So I think they do have like an optimum range that they, they sort of like work within. So we'll just take that and move him uh, over here. But as, of course, it's too steep, so we won't. And there. Uh, sure. Okay, so those guys, they're going to get stinky shops, but it's fine. And hopefully they'll kind of come and like pick up these guys' trash a little bit faster. Okay, Super Jeep, where are we going? Okay, he's still kind of driving, and he now lives here. <laughs>